okay dear student let us see what is there in this question uh which of the two features just a moment okay which of the two features are necessary for the operation of a transformer so what are the two conditions for the transformer to work in the first place number one electrical connection between primary and secondary coil no that there, there is no electrical connection so what is basically the construction of a transformer you see uh, there is this core and the core is created somewhere like this okay and there is this wire having lesser number of turns and there is this wire having more number of turns like I'm talking about step up transformer okay now you see this coil is primary this coil is secondary and how are they connected with each other they are connected magnetically like the magnetic field produced here is now completely shared by <clears throat> uh, with the other coil like this it's completely moving into the other coil and it's coming back like this and we are using the core element there like soft iron we have used why because <clears throat> it is the property of the soft iron that the magnetic flux that enters into the soft iron it never leaks out there's no leakage of the magnetic flux and that is why we use soft iron okay so this is it and so our answer here should be magnetic interaction yes magnetic interaction so either the answer will be b or the answer will be d now what is the another feature that is uh, important now input of alternating current well definitely here the current has to be alternating current it works only on alternating current it does not work for dc so direct current is definitely wrong so b will be the correct answer for us it always work on ac and it always give output also in in the terms of ac only so there is no dc here neither the input nor the output now if you want the dc current what we do we use another device which is called rectifier and that we have done in the semiconductor topic and we we know there are many principles based uh, based on which we create this so ac is converted into dc with the help of rectifier and back again with the help of inverters okay so these are two different phenomena two different uh, devices and transformer is completely third so transformer does not work with dc at all okay okay dear students so this is it b is our correct answer this is professor varun please subscribe to the youtube channel share the youtube channel with all your friends that's very important all the best bye